more than 16,000 people are catching the coronavirus each day, according to the latest COVID symptom study app figures. Analysts crunching numbers from the app, which has been downloaded by more than 4 million Brits, believe that 147,498 people now have COVID-19 in the UK. That number, which does not include long-term sufferers, is significantly more than double the 69,686 people who had the disease last week. They have also calculated that there were 16,130 new daily symptomatic cases in the UK in the two weeks up to September 20. That figure excludes care homes yet is still significantly higher than the number of daily confirmed cases. Yesterday the UK recorded 6,634 new coronavirus cases, according to Department of Health figures from the official Track and Trace service. That is the highest daily figure since mass testing began. Another 40 people's deaths were added to the death toll. Worryingly, in the northwest, case numbers have tripled in the last seven days from 12,544 to 36,316 estimated cases according to the app. Manchester and Bury have two of the highest predicted infection rates in the country, with just shy of 1% of all people there having the bug. In the northeast and Yorkshire numbers have more than doubled from 12,916 to 27,731. This doubling of cases is also seen in London, where cases have gone from 9,291 to 18,200. Other areas, such as the southwest, have not been hit anywhere near as severely by the coronavirus. On average 568 cases were recorded a day in the region, with estimated active cases only rising slightly, to shy of 5,000 in the past week. Tim Spector, Professor of Genetic Epidemiology at King's College London, said, the number of cases in the UK continues to rise at an alarming rate as we are seeing figures doubling weekly across the country. In particular we are worried about places like London and other major cities like Manchester, Belfast and Glasgow where cases are surging and the R value is around 1. 4. The government has confirmed that our data from our loyal app users is playing a critical role and currently providing the most up-to-date figures, 